So hi guys and everyone welcome to today's tutorial showing you how to simply get a 737-800 or any other PMDG livery onto the aircraft in Flight Simulator X. Going from the PMDG website to the livery manager on the 737-NGX. So today, uh, this like I said, this applies for any aircraft on Flight Simulator FSX in 2004. First thing you need to do is open up a uh, Google and type in PMDG liveries and then click on the first one which is add liveries for PMDG simulations. As you can see, this is you can choose from the top here what liveries you would like to choose. We're going to choose 737 800 slash 900 NGX and we are going to choose the uh, livery from the list below. Going down the livery, uh, livery list, we're going to choose the Norwegian Air Shuttle and you simply just got to press FSX version. as shown and as you can see it's popped up down the bottom there and it's going to start the installing there now like I said uh, you can go on either of these uh, tabs at the top to see what aircraft you want to be if you want to 2004 or something like that if you scroll down to the bottom there is indeed uh, the liveries that 737-900 on the other tab and uh, this current tab here on the 737-600-700, scroll down. Is the seven, seven, uh, if you scroll down, there's the 737-700 for FSX. So, like I said, I've got quite a lot of these liveries. Um, they don't charge you anything. It's just the free liveries. There's no restriction on how many you can get, but it's just uh, nice to be flying on that sim network with some livery. Anyway, we've opened it up now. Yeah, I'll use WinRAS, I have not all my files, and you see we've got a folder in there. Uh, I only have the one folder in here which we're going to drag to the desktop. So as you can see, we've dragged to the desktop, dragged it to the desktop, and there it is. Now, you just go find the livery manager, which is on Windows 8, so I'm going to start. And we're just looking for the livery manager for PMDG. And as you can see, we have found it. That's livery manager. You might have your Windows 7, you have to search for it or something like that. Now, all you've got to simply do is press select livery, as uh, so a correction, select the aircraft to 800 uh, winglets, select livery to install. And then you have to go on the desktop. And then the one you put there is very simply. You've just got to uh, double click that or press it once and press the enter tab on your keyboard, and uh, there we go. I've already got this one installed, but it doesn't matter, it can uh, just pop up this. Uh, if you have already got it installed, I advise you just press yes anyway, and if not, uh, it should just install or you don't have to press yes. Um, it's a very simple tutorial. This, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Um, like I said, I have not been uploading quite a lot recently. I have not been uploading quite a lot recently, so don't worry, because there is going to be a lot of videos coming soon. Um, so, like and subscribe, and check out all the links in below. Thank you very much for watching, and goodbye.